Let us pray. Thank you, Jesus, for this wonderful your people. Oh, Lord, please forgive us our sins. Grant them, God, your peace. Give them your spirit and loose them from whatever problem they have tonight. Send your spirit, oh God. You have always used me. Now hide me because I am dirt. But Lord, use me as your instrument tonight. Police was not charged for anything that he didn't want to happen. So I know how the family of Vladimir feels. And to help everyone understand, I always try to say, imagine if it was your little brother or if it was your little sister. Or imagine if it was you. Imagine how Vladimir felt in the last moments of his life. Imagine how frightened he was. Imagine his friend, how he felt. This is all just, it's not right and we need justice and we all need to fight for it. We all need to come out, especially the young ones that can. We need to come out and we need to fight for what we want. Although it is right that the police got charged with murder, although it shouldn't have happened in the first place, we still need to fight for justice. The system needs to change. We need a change. Amen. Thank you all for being here tonight. All your support at this difficult time was very much appreciated and of great comfort to Ladi's family. I want to thank Mr. Ray for being here with us and for all of you and all who participated in this event and everyone of you who came out tonight. Once again, thank you very much. All right, first of all, I'd like to congratulate this young man for doing a great job here in Punta Gorda. I hope that you continue to do it. I wish that more youths and more people would have come out because this not only affects Ladi Jilit, we have to have stand up for justice for the Belizean people, for our children, for our youths. We need justice for Ladi and we need justice in the entire country of Belize for all of us. Justice for Ladi. Daughter, seek justice for Ladi. Well, I feel good because I'm out here to stand up as a young person to seek justice for um, Lady Gillette because it couldn't be anyone a we and where the police to just wrong and the whole police that just a gang itself and we need justice. Okay, I'm Will Mejia, I'm right here in PG Tong and I stop out here today, I see a lot of youths, I see the balloon and I just want to really congratulate the youths for taking the initiative. This is what it's all about. The youths taking the initiative, being the leader. I see all young people out here leading this vigil tonight, and I just want to congratulate everybody, all the organizers for that. So good job, youths. Justice for Lali. It's so sad that this young man passed away at a young age. He didn't experience the life most of us adults have experienced. I feel for the to seek justice for Lali. I'm really happy that PG come together and try make some change in our community and in our country. It's really important that our government see the people and see what we try to say for come together and reform our police because this is unacceptable.